So a balloon is inflated with some volume of air, we'll say three liters. And then the entire balloon is submerged in water to a depth of, we'll say, 10 meters. What we want to do is determine the balloon's new volume. Okay, so the first thing we do always is draw a picture. So here is our picture. We'll use classic color for the balloon. Red balloon. And this balloon is under the pressure of one atmosphere to begin with, which is 1.013 times 10 to the fifth newtons per square meter pascals. And the initial volume of this balloon is 3 liters. And we want to know what happens when This balloon is submerged underwater. Presumably, it's going to shrink a little bit. We don't know this new pressure, nor do we know the volume, but we do know the depth. So, where do we start? We start by determining this pressure. And the way we'll do that is using a static fluid pressure equation, which is P, the pressure at some depth H, is equal to P0, the pressure at the surface, plus rho GH. Rho is going to be the density of our fluid. G is going to be the acceleration due to gravity, acting like a constant in this instance, and H is going to be depth. So we get P is equal to, well, the pressure at the surface is going to be one atmosphere, so 1.013 times 10 to the fifth newtons per square meter, plus rho, uh, the density of water is 1,000 kilogram meters cubed, times 9.8 meters per second squared, times a depth of 10 meters. That gives us a pressure of 1,000, sorry, 199,300 pascals or newtons per meter squared. So now what we're going to do is use Boyle's Law to determine the new volume of our balloon. Boyle's Law states that the product of pressure and volume is constant. So here we're looking for V2. So V2 is equal to V1 times P1 over P2, which gives us V2 equals 3 liters times 1.013 times 10 to the fifth newtons per meter squared divided by the pressure down here, which is going to be 199. 300 newtons per meter squared. Our units are going to cancel here and we're left with meters. And that is equal to 1.52 liters. So there you have it.